do these ball handling drills for just five minutes every single day and I promise you that you will become a better ball handler. Quick taps, we're moving the ball as fast as we can using our fingertips. We're then working on bringing the ball extended in front of us. Our forearms are really burning, bring the ball high and just go from high down to low, keeping that ball moving as fast as you can using your fingertips. You gotta go really fast on the bottom so that it doesn't fall down on the floor. Next, we're doing squeeze the banana. You're literally squeezing the ball from one side to the other, trying to go as fast as you can. Going around your body, then around your legs, bringing it back up, and then even going around your head. Once you get good with this, go the opposite direction. Try to go as fast as you can and really challenge yourself. To start off, go ahead and let it bounce once. Once you get good at this, don't let it bounce. Catch it straight in the air. That's one in front, one behind. Then two in front, two behind. Let it bounce once and then catch it straight in the air without letting it hit the ground. All right, now we're doing our ball handling. We're doing right hand. Balls out in front of us, going in and out. And then we have it on the side going front and back. Then we're switching to our left hand, in and out. And then bring it to the side, front and back. Keep your head up, go as fast as you can, challenge yourself so that you mess up sometimes. Next, we're doing one dribble between. One dribble between. After that, go back door. One dribble between. Go every single dribble between your legs. Go as fast as you can. Then go the opposite direction. Back door. Every single dribble. Now we're doing small dribbles. Figure eight. Try to keep your head up, do a better job than I do here. When you get good with that, you can also go the opposite direction. Now we're doing two ball dribbling, alternating dribble. Then we're doing it at the same time. Front and back. In and out. Again, keep your head up, challenge yourself. Now that you've got your stationary ball handling down, you're going to want to watch my next video where I talk about actually moving with the ball and using different dribble moves to get down the court. Check it out right now.